and I wanted to just um, update my original video. Um, just quickly, let's have a look at my loadout. So, this is the gun you're going to see me uh, use in the little quick um, new version. The sight is now my favorite sight, so that's the one you see in the video. SLO 19. And um, this is an amazing rifle. If you get a chance to roll this, I would pick it up. Uh, this is a shotgun I like. Um, it has full auto and it's quick to reload or quicker than some of the other ones that I have. And then of course raise later. In terms of the, the you know arms and stuff, I just go heavy for um, intelligence and discipline. And in here, importantly, this is how you want to set up. So, illuminated, which means it's your uh, buffs and your bubble and stuff is going to last longer. Um, relentless, which means that when you start a force barrier, it's going to last longer because it'll it'll just have better power. Um, unbreakable. Uh, this way, if the force barrier takes damage, it won't stay damaged. It'll come back over time, like your health tends to. Um, busting of light and just increased height. Uh, so that's how mo I'm loaded out. Um, and then I'm just going to cut straight to the, the end of Crota's End here. So right here, all I'm trying to do is leave myself a single ad. And the reason I want to leave an ad is because I want to use him to start my overshoot. So that's the guy. I'm just going to leave a little bit of him. And then run up and punch him. The idea here is you need to get to the door as quickly as possible. The faster you get there, the less thralls are in the way. As it is, if you see the door opening, that means thralls are going to come out first. If you run right up to the door and the door is still shut, that usually means that the sword bearer is going to come out straight away. Okay, here, throw the shield up. Now, Proto has a weird thing where if you jump high at him like that, he won't swing at you. So, I drop the sword, hit him with Ray Slider, pick the sword back up, and give him two whacks. He only needs six. And then go back. Same same thing. Two, drop drop out of there. I should have run straight back to the level there, but um, my mind was thinking about going into the uh, ogre cave down there. Right, and I'm gonna sort of spare everybody the next bit, which is effectively just waiting around. There we go. So do the same thing again, over shield up. Not that I really need it here, but there's no thralls because I've already shot them all up, except for that last one. Shield up, grab the sword, drop the sword, raise later up. Do this. Anyhow, that's my tweaked version of doing it with the Titan uh, that includes the over. Shield, uh, easy, easy. 